Larpurinos, it's Arby from Of Science and Swords with a very quick unveiling video of Epic Armory's latest greenskin design. You're all familiar with the malicious goblin, those little green skin scallywags that run around and plant explosives in the base of your walls and towers at various LARP events. Well, we've decided that we need more variety of goblins here because after all, we've already got five types of orcs, but only two types of goblins. So, introducing a brand new design of goblin, the Malignant Goblin. Available in two different colors, the Malignant Goblin is markedly different departure from its malicious cousin. As you can see already, they are of different sizes, and this isn't just the dummy head inside. Oh no, these are actually different size masks entirely. This one will even fit my gigantish, trollish sized head. As with all Epic Armory masks, they are made from an incredibly durable, good quality latex designed to take a hit. And they slip on quite easily. Now, obviously the chin has been left out so that you can actually emote and use your mouth. Having slipped it on as easily as that, and you know I've got all of that hair to deal with, it's actually a fairly comfortable mask. What's really great about these is that we finally have a green skin mask, or, you know, even paler than green if you so choose, that is going to fit people with an XL to 2XL sized head. In fact, there's even a little bit of wiggle room in this one for me. And I'm already at a whopping 63 and a half centimeters circumference for my gigantic noggin. The primary difference in circumference size of the heads is the fact that the Malicious Goblin is a 57 to 59, which puts it in a small to medium head size category against the Epic Armory sizing chart. So now we have something that's going to be large enough to suit the ogre-sized people without having to be specifically an ogre build. One of the primary differences between the Malicious and the Malignant Goblin, of course, not just being the design, is also the paint that's been in use. The Malignant Goblin has more of a sheen to the top of it, whereas the Malicious Goblin actually has a matte paint to it. This gives the Malignant Goblin a bit of a sick, feverish, greasy, sweaty kind of look, which is meant to go hand in hand with them being a goblinoid species, but also to provide a potential different environment. Of course, if you want that look out of the malicious goblin, you can always spray it up with a good deal of Epic Armory silicon maintenance oil. It will give it a nice sheen and it will also hydrate the latex whilst it's not in use. This will prolong its life and give you a disgustingly greasy feel when you smear your cheeks against other players' faces. Durability-wise, I'm once again very impressed by the quality of Epic Armory's latex. You can see my knuckles going white with the strain as I attempt to tear it and absolutely no damage. I am fairly confident that you could take a face plant into the dirt wearing this mask it will be fine and easy to clean. So we hope you like the new addition to Epic Armory's ever-growing family of greenskins and the Epic FX prosthetics line. We hope to see you as goblins on the battlefield.